The CDC doesn't think Americans will stop dying from COVID-19 anytime soon. The agency predicts we will hit 200,000 deaths by September 19th. That's thousands, more than what they predicted last week. More than 180,000 have already died in the U.S. The Sigma Alpha Epsilon fraternity at CU Boulder faces a fine after 120 people crowded their house on the hill Wednesday night. CU says anyone who violates a public health order by going to a party will be banned from the campus and required to do remote learning only for at least two weeks and placed on probation. The vice chancellor for the student affairs says people who break the rules once will be put on notice. Twice is a suspension. A customer is caught on video shoving a bartender to the ground in Golden, the owner of the Golden Moon Speakeasy. Says it happened after the bartender confronted him for not wearing a mask. John Roche now faces trespassing and harassment charges. And social distancing rules can mean an awkward empty space at some restaurants. One restaurant in Greenwood Village is having some fun with it. Benedict's is filling the seats with well-known faces. So we've got Bert and Ernie sitting on one table, um, Jaws sitting on another. We've got one table reserved for Tom Brady and the New England Patriots with a half deflated football. I wonder how that one went. Uh, most popular celebrity, Bob Ross, who sits in the booth up front, Richard says, customers like to take pictures with all the celebrities.